In this video, let's see another numerical problem, this time also based on chain rule asked in the year of 2005 in the CBSC previous year examination. But the question this time is not a solution based question, rather a proof based question. The question says if y is equal to something called as this, then prove that dy by dx is something called as this. For proving, first let's find out dy by dx, then we'll see what the question has to say. So let's start with the solution, we'll be a bit quick, I give the heading as proof because this is not a solution based but a proof based question. Y is given to you, what about dy by dx? Simply speaking we have done this type of question earlier so it is not difficult for us. dy by dx is what? The whole bracket comprises of the power raised to n. So it is something called as x raised to n. And the differentiation is nx raised to the power n minus 1. So the same thing I'm telling you, n into x means the whole thing again. Raised to the power of n minus 1, n minus 1. But the question doesn't stop here. Since it is the chain rule, we saw earlier there was a bracket. So we encountered a bracket. Then we went inwards and we found very more things. Many more things are in store for us. So we went for the differentiation again and the differentiation of the bracket this time, let's make it one step at a time, differentiation of this thing. And we had done this type of question, the first question was actually of this type only based on chain rule. So this is not difficult for us. Let's now continue. It is n x plus root a square plus x square raised to the power n minus 1 d by dx of this thing. This thing is also not difficult for us. x is nothing but what having the differentiation of 1 plus this is having the differentiation of 1 by 2 under root of this whole thing copied as it is, right? Next is what? Next is nothing but our encounter with something called as the a square plus x square. See, what we did, we encountered x, we put the differentiation. We encountered root, we put the differentiation. But when we saw that the root was not over, we have something else also. So we have to do differentiation of that also. What is the differentiation of a square plus x square? Only a square plus x square. See, a square has differentiation of 0 being a constant, x square that of 2x. If you are not following this, it is better you watch the previous video, chain rule question number 1. That will uh, actually show you the differentiation of this thing as a whole. Right? Continuing, n x plus under root a square plus x square power n minus 1 multiply. What is there? 0 plus 2x makes it 2x only. So 1 plus 2x upon 2 under root a square plus x square. Anything cancels? Yes, you are right. 2 and 2 gets cancels. Some things can be taken out as LCM also. So let's take the LCM and x plus under root a square plus x square raised to the power n minus 1. Something can be taken as an LCM. Let's take it. It is x plus under root a square plus x square because this becomes upon 1 upon under root a square plus x square. I hope you are following and you must have also seen one thing that these two things are the same. This has power 1, this has power n minus 1. Now you know this kind of rule. The rule is what? The rule is if you have a raised to the power m multiplied by a raised to the power n, it says a raised to the power m plus n. So that is what we will be doing. We will be basically seeing and adding up the powers. So next step becomes what? Next step is very simple. n outside, then you have this as n minus 1 power, you have this as 1 power. So they add n minus 1 plus 1. Minus 1 plus 1 gets cancelled. Only power is n. So x plus under root a square plus x square power is n. Then upon under root a square plus x square. Now see one thing. Do you find this familiar to something? What was y? y is here. Let's make it more clear. y was x plus under root a square plus x square raised to the power n. Here also you have x 
plus under root a square plus x square raised to the power n. So can you not substitute it equal to y? Yes, you can. So it is what? n into y. And the rest cannot you substitute. So it is a square plus x square only. So you started with the finding of dy by dx. You got this thing. And you see this only you had to prove. So it is basically y from where? From question. And hence proved that yes, my dy by dx is equal to ny upon under root a square plus x square. Let's write it hence proved. So this was a simple question based on the CBSC previous examination. The year was 2005. The topic was chain rule.